Nature so in the building. Sun gazer so in the building. Now listen, I want to talk to y'all about the music that y'all listen to. Now y'all know once you become, y'all know once you, bro, I remember XXX. XXX was one of the most, y'all know he was a woke rapper, bro. No wonder the nigga dead, bro. Obviously they was going to kill him. XSX said something in the back in the day, like before he passed and shit, when he was like doing his little, y'all know he used to like be speaking a lot of, a lot about real shit. At the time, I was too busy focused on trying to hit a million subscribers. I was just too lost in the sauce. I was all on YouTube. But like I said, once you take time out your day, you get away from all these friends, all these people that's just in the way. You don't need friends. Once you start to get time to yourself and start connecting with yourself and you start researching stuff, you will look at everything totally different. Now, let me tell y'all about the music that y'all listen to on a regular basis. Most of the music that we listen to, that we listen to, most of the hood, the hood music, most of the music that's on the top charts, is played through it's, it's played through bad frequencies. Now it's a frequency four four four. What is it? Four thirty two hertz is the good shit, right? Then you got another frequency that's four forty hertz. That's what most of the music that we listen to. So say for instance, say for instance, you go to a concert. At that concert, you drunk as hell, you drunk all type of shit, you with a whole bunch of people. Y'all in the concert, y'all lit as fuck, y'all having the funnest time of y'all life. Little do y'all know, y'all are surrounded by nothing but bad, dark energy. Most of the music that you listen to, you could be in a car on your way to work, just having a regular nice day, and you turn on the music, and out of nowhere, you start feeling moody, you start feeling depressed. And it's not the music, it's not the artist, it's the frequency that they playing the music on. So you have 432 frequency. Look it up on YouTube, bro. Look it up right now when y'all done with this video. 432 hertz versus 440 hertz. Now you can listen to Old Town Road, right? Say if it's you listening to Old Town Road on the radio. You can feel perfectly fine while listening to it. But say for instance, you put that same Old Town Road under 440 hertz frequency. You can't, you don't notice the frequency. You just notice your body changing. You notice you starting to get depressed, moody, anxiety. You start feeling weird. You just, you, your day seem fucked up for no reason. It's the frequency that you playing. Now, XSX was saying a little bit of shit. He was saying like how he could put, how people put different frequencies and different hurt, whatever y'all want to call it, bro. He was saying all this shit before he passed. And it didn't click with me because I wasn't on the same frequency as him. My consciousness was my consciousness was not high enough to relate to what he was saying. I couldn't even relate to none of his new music because I was too far lost and I was just I was dumb as hell. I wasn't meditating or nothing. I was a regular ass nigga. I didn't understand him. Now that he gone, now that he dead and gone, and I look back at his interviews, XXX and XXX Tentacion was damn near literally the only woke rapper. He had a spiritual awakening. That nigga knew that what he was doing was terrible. He knew he was wasting his time. He wasn't doing shit that was for his purpose. So he started changing his music. Start talking more about depression and stuff that he was going through. They don't like that. They don't want you to talk about stuff that can help people. They don't want you. They don't want to tell you that most of the music on the top charts today is played under 440 frequencies when you listen to it on iTunes and Spotify. They got apps that you can download, 432 Hertz apps. You could play all your music and everything through this app. No, you cannot see frequencies. No, you cannot see it with these two eyes, bro. You have to raise your level of consciousness, meditate, take care of yourself, and you will start seeing shit. You will start understanding the shit that you never was under, could understand because you was just not, your brain wasn't, you wasn't working on your mind. So this is what happens, y'all. You wake up in the morning, you listen to your favorite song. Out of nowhere, you start feeling moody, anxious, anxiety, depressed. It's not the song fault. It's not your fault. It's nothing wrong with you. It's the frequency that that song is playing on. Pay attention to your body. Pay attention to how you feeling. Pay attention to everything. Everything you was taught was a lie. Basketball, football, everything is controlled. Music, everything is controlled. 
Think about it. It's a billion niggas that hoop and only 300 make it to the NBA. Out of a billion people, only 300 is chosen. A lot of niggas is wasting their life. I wish I would never play basketball my entire life. I would have been doing some other shit. Maybe YouTube... Maybe YouTube took me away from that shit for a reason. YouTube took me away from all the people that was around me for a reason. So I could get this information and bring it to y'all. Once again... Download the app 3... Download the app 432 Hertz. When I end this video, I want y'all to look up 432HZ versus 4408Z. Most of the music today is played under that dark energy ass frequency that causes us depression. Have us moody. You be in a concert, you drunk as hell, you around all this badass energy. All this type of shit flowing around you that you can't see with these two eyes until you start upping your level of consciousness. Y'all all turned up and then y'all come home hungover the next day. Y'all moody, y'all tired, y'all have no energy to do nothing. You just spent all your energy at a concert under all that dark energy, etc. Even clubs, clubs, the same thing. You go to a club, they got that 440 hertz music playing in clubs. All that shit, bro. I know all this shit. Now, it's crazy how I feel like I'm smart, but I'm the same. I'm the same nigga I always been. I just started getting the answers from myself. I started searching shit myself. I don't watch the news. I don't remember the last time I watched the news. The news is fake. It just keeps you annoyed and keeps your mind focused on shit that's not even real. Most of the shit on the news is fake. It's made up stories to keep you wondering and worried. Simple. Watch what y'all niggas listening to. That nigga XXX was right about that music, bruh. They putting 440 hertz music. They making niggas depressed just listening to some bangers. I can't even listen to my favorite songs without getting stressed and depressed. I turn to music for stress and depression. Little do they know the music is what's doing it to them. And then they give you pills, tell you to go to the doctor and get pills. The pills is going to make your shit worse. <laughs> Stay woke, y'all. Now I'm out, bruh.